The sailor critically injured in a Coronado carjacking this weekend is not expected to survive. One of the teens accused of trying to steal Navy sailor Eddie Foster's car facing a judge today. The violence had unfolded early Sunday when callers reported seeing a man on the windshield of a car that had crashed into the Coronado toll booths. Foster was found unconscious by first responders lying in the roadway. He's since been on life support. 18-year-old Ricardo Gongora, who you see there, is facing DUI and attempted murder charges connected to that carjacking. Foster's family speaking about the tragedy. He was moonlighting, um, delivering packages for, through Amazon. Um, he would pick up shifts. Him and his wife actually would go out together and um, they deliver packages in was, the evenings or mornings. I was supposed to be there with him. I we didn't get to go that morning. Or I probably would have been there to, you know, protect him or something. He so. would have been in the car. He wouldn't have been out there running. Yeah. The package. There would have been two of us, you know. Like, and I just can't help but kind of blame myself for it, you know. Because he should have been home. I called him at 6 o'clock. He didn't answer. I called him at 8. He didn't answer. No, I didn't even find out my husband was in there until like 9.30. He was in there since 5.30. He's a good man. He didn't deserve to go out like this. His kids are devastated. Devastated. They just want his dad to come home. They don't understand. That's not right. I don't know why God chose him. <laughs> He was 33 years old. Gongora is being held without bail pending his next court appearance. If convicted, he faces 15 years to life in prison.